Hello everybody, it's me Janet again. Sorry of having no time for you, but I expanded my company. Now we have done with it, so today I can show you how to clean the teeth by using the laser. Therefore, we will combine the Erbium Yak laser and the diode laser. Just come over and let us start. Cleaning of teeth by using a laser, let us call this kind of treatment the cleaning and care package, is a combination out of the conventional and modern treatment in dentistry. So, what does it mean? It means that we take the advantages out of both med medical equipments. So, our treatment procedure is divided in three steps. Step number one is taking off the tartar. Therefore, we will use the conventional, um, the conventional uh, ultrasound um, dental scaler in combination with the Erbium Yak laser. In step number two, we will uh, polish it, the tooth surface and in the last and third step we will take off the hypersensitive of the tooth neck. Before I start, of course, we will make a picture so you can see the uh, tooth before. As you can see on the picture, the tooth surface shows uh, discoloration and tartar. And the aim of our treatment is to have a bright and healthy surface. I will start with step number one, taking off the tartar by using our ultrasonic uh, dental scaler. The advantages of this kind of dental scaler is that it does takes off the tartar very quickly. The disadvantages is uh, it does hurt at the sensitive tooth neck. This is the reason why I change my medical equipment and at the sensitive tooth neck I will use the Erbium Yak laser to take off the tartar and therefore we do have to wear our laser safety glasses and just come a bit near and have a look. The advantages of taking off the tartar with the Erbium Yak laser is it does not hurt, it's nearly painless at the hypersensitive tooth and uh, of course I said every uh, medical equipment has a disadvantages, also the erbium, because you can see it works a bit slower compared to the ultrasonic. Before we go to step number two, just come a bit near, I want to show you the surface uh, of the teeth by using these two different medical uh, equipments. As you can see, uh, on the right hand, uh, we use the uh, dental scaler and can you see this kind of bleeding spot? And uh, compared to the treatment by using the Erbium Yak laser, there's no bleeding spot. Okay, now let us go to, uh, over to step number two, the polishing. And you do already know that we cannot polish with the laser, so we take the air flows. Okay, now we do the polishing of the tooth surface by using the airflow with our granulat nano beam and it's an additive to get a very nice shiny surface. Okay, the tooth surface is clean and it's polished. Uh, to come to the third step, we do have to change our laser safety glasses, therefore um, I give you the new glasses. And the third and last step is to get rid of the hypersensitive at the tooth neck. 
to taking off the hypersensitive of the two snack, um, I s uh, told you we have three possibilities. You can take the erbium yak, the neodymium yak, or the diode laser. In this case, I prefer the diode laser because uh, this kind of laser has a very deep penetration depth and so we are able to take off the sensitive. I would like to take a picture so you are able to compare before and after the treatment. Uh, now the two pictures, before and after. Before you can see the discoloration and the tartar on the two surface. After the treatment you can see the sealed, cleaned and bright tooth surface. To sum up for you, as you could see, there is no medical equipment which only has advantages. To have a good result and a nearly painless treatment for the patient. You have to hold out the advantages of each device. And yes, the laser treatment goes beyond the primary care. This is how we work here. I hope I could inspire you. See you next time. I count on you. Sorry of having no time for you for such a long time. Machen wir nochmal. Okay. Ja. Sorry of having no time for you. Nee, ich habe den Faden verloren, Ethan. This is the combination of um, nee, das ist auch doof. Das ist doof.